In the late 1920s and early 1930s, industrial designer Norman Bel Geddes amazed the world with his futuristic designs. Many of his City of Tomorrow and Automobile of Tomorrow and Home of Tomorrow designs became the talking point for newspapers, magazines, radio programs, and films. By 1939, Bel Geddes' designs were so popular that he was asked by General Motors to design their pavilion, known as Futurama, for the 1939 New York World's Fair. Bel Geddes opened his design studio in 1927 and began rethinking everything from home decor to airplanes. His 1932 book Horizons had such an impact that it became jokingly nicknamed a Book of Prophecy. One year before Branham's alleged 1933 prophecy of the egg-shaped car, Bel Geddes published the blueprints for streamlining automobiles to make them more aerodynamic. Some of his ideas were on display as prototypes at the 1933 Chicago World's Fair that William Branham himself attended. In 1940, Bel Geddes published another book, Magic Motorways, which described the future of the automotive industry. In the book, Bel Geddes described self-driving vehicles. It should come as no surprise that William Branham also claimed to have prophesied that automobiles would become autonomous in later versions of his 1933 prophecy accounts. It does not appear to be a result of Bel Geddes' second book, however. The timeline of William Branham's introducing self-driving cars is more closely aligned with the Central Power and Light Company's advertisements of the car of the future. You can learn this and more on william-branham.org.